So uh, this probably isn't going to be kid friendly. My language is probably going to be not nice. And excuse me, I got Jerry, who is, I never thought I'd own a damn poodle. But anyways, global genocide. Now I didn't do a video on it. One, because I was like, you know what? I want to see if you guys will see it. How awake is even the prepping community to be able to see? Not very, <laughs> which is kind of annoying. Oh man. And then on top of it, how long are the normies gonna latch onto it? Cause I was hoping that you guys would see it and then start pushing it out there, but you didn't. That's okay. It's okay, I'm not mad at you. So Afghanistan, uh, you wanna talk about an FF that has been perpetrated with casualties involved. It is that. And at the same time, a lot of fake optics. And the one that got me was, it was pretty much the very first day of video coming out. They're coming around the corner of a building and they're going, shots are fired, shots are fired. And the crowd is running. And I shit you not, hopefully I don't trip and look really stupid. Not that this guy was any smarter. So he's running and he's like this. <laughs> when you're scared shitless, running from bullets, that's not how you run. <laughs> you do not run like that. I looked at that and I was like, what the actual hell? This ain't real. I'm looking at all the little parents and the little kids that are over there. I'm going, nah, -uh. my kid would not be walking if I was terrified and there was bullets. My mama ass would be grabbing some children up. They'd be tucked under like footballs and we would be hauling balls. But no, you know, when you're trying to freak everyone out and look over here, look over here, look, 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 this is what you get. Yeah, Jerry. So what did we get out of this false flag? What, What is going on? So I was letting it go, I let it go, let it go. I may do a video on it, it'll be a late one. As far as, you know, an after the current events one, just to point out, duh. But I thought, well, what's going to happen with this? You know, they're suppressing all the COVID stuff so badly, it's, it's ridiculous. And the, the dollar and the, the monetary system's getting really, suppressed so what, what's going on with this and I thought numbers are coming out people are really starting then to look and then this morning ivermectin is trending I was like ah that's good news because if they're looking for ivermectin the little part of their brain is going that shit ain't working whether they believe that it's going to kill them or not the shit ain't working I was like, oh so good news so with this ff they have pretty much destroyed Biden and any reputation he had. It, it is gone. It, it is gone everywhere. UK has gone so far as to sit there and say, he's so bad, we're going to vote on it. Uh, Harris, a little bit, I mean, they're, I think they're feeling her out to sit there and see how the public will react. Unfortunately, nobody likes her. They picked a real moron it's kind of like who decided you could at least gotten somebody who was dumb that people liked in her spot. Anybody but her. But nobody likes her. So they've done a little bit of that. Uh, they've gone so far as to really destroy any U.S. credibility for war stuff. And Millie, that was the other piece that came through when I sit there and was hearing about that. We didn't have any intelligence. It's like, mm, yeah, mm-hmm. I thought, what in the hell? So if you're, if this is controlled demolition, and if we still believe that, because remember, we're intelligent people, so as evidence comes through, we change our minds. This would be part of it. Because in order to destroy and to rebuild new, this is kind of like what has to happen. It's like, ah, Millie's lying out his ass. And... Austin, I shit you not, they're like this. They're like little buddies. They're so tied into each other. It's crazy. And I didn't like Austin. 
mainly not from his body language, but from his uh, thought process. He's like, I don't like that. What the hell? I'm not into that shit. He's like, what is going on? Hmm. We don't know the ins and outs. We do know, well, we do what looks like, you know, walks like duck, talks like duck, it's a duck. This looks like controlled demolition. And the military seems to be in on it. Because who else would know? Who else would know? <laughs> so, stop looking at Afghanistan. In the sense of do not forget everything else. The voter fraud. That's a huge one. Because if they don't fix it, there's no country. No matter what. Uh, what else? Don't forget about this global genocide. Urgh. I mean, I live in a town where I did not know that just about every one of these people are morons. Morons. And you know what? And the sad thing is, I like some of these morons. Yes, morons. I can't say that word enough. Morons. How dumb can you be to go get an experimental gene therapy? You have no idea what it does. Not has not been tested, didn't do any due diligence to figure out that all the damn animals died from it. And now we've got doctors and scientists, many, many people, and the range is, I'm not going to quote them all, but the range is six months to three years of dying. 70, or not 75, 60 to 75% to 90% of those that got it dying. In this town, I swear, the only people that are going to be left are the village idiot and the children. So all the village idiots are going to be known. I guess they're not that dumb if they didn't get the damn shot. <laughs> I got to go find Jerry. He ran off on me.